Hi, I am Leon McJunkins, and I am doing my project on Katoria Hall. Born on May 10th, 1981 in Memphis, Tennessee, first African-American valedictorian at Craigmont High School, went to Columbia University in 2003 and Juilliard in 2009. American activist, playwright, journalist, and actress. These are some plays that she's best known for. Mountain Top, which portrayed the events that ended up to Martin Luther King's death. Hurt Village, Who Do Love, Saturday Night, Sunday Morning, Our Lady of Cabejo, The Blood Quilt. She won the Lawrence Oliver American Airlines Award for Best Play, nominated for Audi Award for Audio Drama in 2017, Charles MacArthur Award of Outstanding Original New Play or Music, musical in 2016 for the blood quilt. Arcabota and the one you never forget are some movies she was in. Hurt Village. This play is about a retired vet that comes home and sees how his hometown has changed after he retired from the Marines. He tries to make his hometown better and sees that poverty has gotten worse. The characters are Cookie, Crank, Big Mama, Buggy, Cornbread, Toya, Ebony, Skillet, and Tony C. Cookie is 13 and the daughter of Crank and Buggy granddaughter of Big Mama. Crank is a female Cookie's mother and gave birth at age 13. Big Mama is head of the household, Buggy's grandmother and Cookie's great grandmother. Buggy is a Marine grandson of Big Mama, Cookie's father and son of Tiffany who took her own life. Cornbread is a multiracial male FedEx employee, friend of Buggy, and helps support Cookie. Toya is the mother of Cornbread's child. Ebony is a male and works for Tony C. Skillet is a male, tall and thin. Tony C. is a male and 40 years of age. The analysis is the play is very interesting because Buggy comes back home to a lot of changes and tries to stand up for what he believes in, but also loses his family in the process. Cookie wants to go to a rally with Big Mama instead of moving there with her parents because Crank is using a gang while her father is in an altercation with Tony C. In Act 1, Crank and Big Mama argues about welfare benefits. The Black aesthetics are community and family as cultural bearers signifying Love is a revolutionary and transformative act. The end. Four minutes, 30 seconds.